write my own story and why should people come and watch it? Well, up to this point, my experience with stories have been very different. Uh, brief summary, when I was very young, I had was more Disney and Sunday school stories, movies. As I grew up, it was more movies, novels that I read. And then it became more about performing a story. And when I taught at Waldorf, I was introduced to a different way of working with stories. And this way reminded me of when I was very young because we would actually sit and listen to someone telling a story. It was during this time that I also started a book called Women Who Run With The Wolves, which is filled with many different stories. And um, it was the combination of working with Women Who Run With The Wolves and the courses that I was doing at Waldorf that added depth to my understanding and my perspective around stories. So I'll try to give a brief description of those three years. And I'm going to start with a quote from Clarissa Pinkley Estes' book, Women Who Run With The Wolves, because she just says it so beautifully. She says, stories are the simplest and most accessible ingredient towards healing. Now, I didn't understand that at first. And she carries on saying that stories are embedded with instruction, which guide us about the complexities of life. So here's a woman saying that stories can help guide you through challenges that you face in your life. And then she says, they are so powerful that all you need to do, or you don't need to do anything, you don't need to act or perform, all you need to do is listen. So I did. I listened. I listened to all Native African stories, all South African stories, Greek stories, Native American stories, stories from all different parts of the world. And I started to understand this concept around ingredient for healing. The story brought me a lot of joy when I was working with them. It was a lot of fun to work with them. I looked forward, I was inspired. And without, without having to try to find value or, you know, trying to look for it, it sort of found me. As an actress, I've always been a storyteller. And now I am a writer of them too. After the last art course I did, I was so inspired to tell my own story. And the story is a reflection of the art course and focuses on finding the value within. And transforming your scar into a treasure. So, why should you come and watch my show? Well, firstly, because all you need to do is listen. And secondly, because I believe my show is an example for the potential in growth, in taking a journey through your own life, which we all have in common, growing up. And lastly, because I believe we all have a scar, whether it's physical or emotional, whether it's recent or in the past. It has a story and this show is an example of transforming that and gaining the value in the lessons that we learn from our scars.